Well, this is the one we've been waiting for. We being Martin Tyler and Alan Smith in the commentary box, and you, of course, ready to watch the game unfold. Yeah. Can't wait for this one. This match is Norwich City against Oxford United. Oxford United. Well, they will be absolutely desperate not to let that home defeat in their previous game affect them today, namely that loss against Brighton and Hove Albion. Maybe a, a touch unlucky to lose 3-1 that day, but uh, I think they can get a draw here. As this league table just reflects. Well, a lot of points still to play for, but um, they've been less than impressive, haven't they? Still time to make amends, but I don't know. A lot of ground to make up now. We've got three changes for Norwich City in this team. Sebastian Basson replaces Russell Martin, who's looked vulnerable recently, and today it's just the one striker in the side. This is the away team lineup, and a look at the opposing side as well. It's pretty similar, Alan, isn't it? It is. I hope we're not in, uh, in for a snore fest here when there's not going to be many chances at either end. Whether the crowd are excited about this or not. They don't seem to be before this match has kicked off. Not a lot of noise in the stadium. And the referee for this match, Scott Duncan. So here we go, we're underway here. Anticipating something special from him here today. Really has weighed in with quite a few goals in this competition. And here's the shot. Oh. And shoots! Oh, he had a real go. Well, you can't knock him. He was in the right place at the right time. Just couldn't... Uh... Tries the through pass. He's got his shot off now. Very good stop here. Well, that is half time. The start now of the second period. They'll get a free kick for that. Three players coming on. the through pass and here's the header it's a very good game here it's a goal for Fulham four minutes remain one nil thank you very much Alan and now the shot great stop well an important corner now let's see what they can do and it's a header here's Alex Pritchard and that's the end of the game and it's finished goalless well, for Perry, it's positive in possession, though, Martin. They didn't try those incisive one-touch passes quite enough. They looked to him, didn't they? But they couldn't quite produce the win that he and they wanted. Well, we were all looking at him before the game.